Check out this old World War II Army Corps of Engineers compass I picked up on Craigslist for 20 bucks. Now what piqued my interest was I was pretty sure back in the day they were using radium to illuminate the dial face on there. And that, I know that's radioactive, but I was curious as to how radioactive it is. So to find out, I got here, this is some americium 241, I'm pretty sure it is. You know, the kind of stuff you get in smoke detectors. So we're gonna find out how radioactive that stuff is. So, see it's on times one. Yeah, it's, that's pretty spicy. Let's do times 10. Yeah, not good. Definitely don't want to be eating that. But that's mostly alpha and beta. So if I close the gamma shield on this, yeah, it goes away. So the question is, What's that like for the compass? Well, let's bring out the old meter. And find out. All right, gamma shield open. Oh, I'm not even near it, and it's already halfway up the scale. And I should probably put on times 10 just to start with. Uh, times 10 wasn't enough. Times 100. Here we go. Oh, that's a hot piece right there. Yeah, alpha and beta, you can block that. So let's see how much of that is blocked. So in theory, with the gamma shield on, only gamma radiation is going to get through. Oh, no. That's a lot of gamma radiation coming out of this thing. And that's still on times 100. So to answer my question is how radioactive were these? Turns out, very. Can't believe people used to just keep this in their pocket.